guys today we are going to let today is criticism on shakespeare part 1 might start this is some on shakespeare pen johnson he told about shakespeare that he redeemed his verses with his virtues there was even more in him to be praised than to be pardoned he was not of an age but for all time john milton he wrote a sonnet titled on shakespeare in 1613 it starts with what needs my shakespeare for his cornered bones the labor of an age in field stones or that his kind of relax should be kindened in another line the son of memory great hero of fame what need as the thou such weak witness of the name The sonnet of Milton appeared in the, the second volume of plays by Shakespeare in 1632 as an epitome of the admirable dramatic poet William Shakespeare. Samuel Pepys, in his diary on 29 September 1662, he wrote to the King's Theatre, where we saw Midsommar Nightshim, which I had never seen before nor shall ever again. what it is the most inspired the close play that ever i saw in my life john trident trident said about shakespeare in his essay of dramatic poetry as to begin then with shakespeare he was the man who of all modern and ancient poets had the largest and most comprehensive soul as rhyme he attacked on othello as the moral swell of this fable is very instructive joseph addison among the english Shakespeare has incomparably excelled all others. Alexander Pope, he wrote about Shakespeare in his preface to Pope's editions of Shakespeare. His character are so much nature, has so that it is a sort of injury to call them by so distance the name of as copies of Kill. Samuel Johnson, he wrote about Shakespeare in the place of William Shakespeare, he wrote in it. Shakespeare's adherence to general nature has exposed him to the censors of critics, who form the judgment of a narrower principles. The same or he wrote, the work of a correct and regular writer is accorded accurately, formed and diligent, planted, varied with shadows, and seasoned with flowers. The composition of Shakespeare is a forest. Johnson also said about him as, Shakespeare opens a mind which contains gold and diamonds in inexcusable plenty. so clouded by incrustation depressed by impurities and mingled with a mass of minerals minerals and shakespeare writes without moral purpose and is more careful to please than his instinct ahan wolf com code there is no pleasure greater and purer than with eyes closed i can be yeah shakespeare's play not declaimed but recited by a safe and natural voice he wrote about shakespeare in case Wilhelm Meister's apprenticeships. He wrote about Hamlet. French Hamlet is suddenly facing the need for a great action, imposed upon a soul that is unable to do it. Perhaps no one has met so great as the first major link of wish and duty in the individual character as Shakespeare did. Music